here. Nice little small mouth. We have a ton of natural colors in the Yum Helgramite. Let's talk about two of my favorites that I'm fishing right now in the stream we're in. The color I have on right here that they've absolutely just decimated so far, this color called Mud Fleck. What this is, this is a black blue top with a cinnamon blue bottom. It's, it's a really great pattern in stained water, which is what we're in right now. It just looks super natural on the bottom with that cinnamon blue bottom, but it also has the black blue top, so it offers something in dirty water so they're able to actually notice it. Great pattern. And then I have another one that I like to always carry with me. This one's called Natural. What this is, this basically looks like a natural crawdad in the water. It's brown, it's got some really cool silver and gold flake in the belly, and then some purple on the back. This is an awesome pattern in stained to clear water, which, you know, we get in certain parts of this creek right now, whenever the water's moving a little more, it gets clearer. I'll pick up something like this so that I have a, a more subtle option for that clear water. Easiest way to pick out the best color yum helgramite for you is whenever you get to wherever you're fishing, your lake, your river, your pond, your creek, take your helgramite, drop it into the water closest to the bank to where you can see it around rocks or cover that you're going to be fishing around. What does that Helgramite look like compared to the bottom? Does it match up with it? Clear water, you want it to match up. So if it's matching in clear water, you're probably picking the right color. If you're in dirty water and you can see it up shallow, it contrasts brightly, you've got the right color for dirty water. That's a super simple way to be able to pick the right color Helgramite. Oh, what do we got here? Get in here, buddy. Oh, it's a good one. Come here. Come here. Yeah. <laughs> oh, he's mad. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, and he choked that thing. Guys, you don't have to have a ton of colors with you. Just make sure you do a little bit of pre-research. Know what you're going to be getting into in the creek, lake, pond, river, wherever you're fishing at. Have a few colors that'll match up to the water clarity and the bottom contour of where you're at. You're going to catch some fish on the um, Helgramite.